All right, in entertainment news, when money is tight, how far would you go to make it big? Over to the criminal side? Aubrey Plaza does in her new movie, Emily the Criminal, a hit at Sundance. Here's Kara Sewell. Hmm? Yeah, you're scared of me. Hmm? Yeah. Aubrey Plaza is known for her edgy indie movies, but Emily the Criminal gets downright dangerous. Yeah, totally. It felt dangerous on, you know, when the camera was rolling and the camera wasn't rolling. There was blood, there were tears, there was dirt, crime. there was crime. Uh, we got it all in there. Sorry, how much uh, interest is being added a month? Emily, yo, let me uh, hook you up. Her character Emily is drowning in debt and can't get a legit job due to a black mark on her record. Opportunity knocks in the form of a credit card fraud ring and getting into what's called dummy shopping. You make that much selling TVs. Sometimes TVs, sometimes other things. This, this is it. This is the partnership. Her partner in crime, Youssef, is played by Theo Rossi. In the next hour, you will make 200 cash, but you will have to do something illegal. He's just a representation of when your back's against the wall, finding something, another path to get what you want. And uh, I think with him on the opposite of Emily, like she wants in it, he wants out of it. You could show me how to do it. I think she wants to make None money, you know? I think her, for her, it's but more about control. Exactly it's almost like she, say, she realizes, you know, I, want, I don't want to, I don't want to, I, I don't want a job in this system, in this climate. I want, I want to be my own boss. Plaza not only stars in the film, she's a producer too. And she likes to manifest her movies right from the start. So, like, so how close did she come to pulling off her vision? Ooh, it's pretty close. It's pretty damn close. This came together and, and was executed in exactly the way that it, that it was meant to be. We're serious people. They should be scared of us. Emily the Criminal is in theaters only and getting great reviews. Who wants to play bodies, bodies, bodies? So how do you play? Okay, also new in theaters, Bodies, Bodies, Bodies. This is a Gen Z horror comedy. A hurricane party game becomes a murder mystery when the guests start turning up dead. Pete Davidson is in this one, along with Maria Bakalova from the last Borat film. Fans embraced Top Gun Maverick this summer, so much so, it's now topping Titanic as the seventh best-selling movie of all time. So it's Fan Appreciation Weekend at theaters. Before screenings, you'll get a behind-the-scenes look aboard the aircraft carrier where the movie was filmed. Now, some theaters will also hand out Maverick we'll collector's prints yourself. while supplies last. You can go to topgunmovie.com for participating now. theaters. Okay, and it's time to get out those Reese's Pieces and phone home. They are re-releasing Steven Spielberg's blockbuster E.T., the extraterrestrial, in IMAX theaters across the country this weekend. Believe it or not, this is crazy. The classic is marking its 40th anniversary. Star Henry Thomas from San Antonio is now 51 years old. And following the death of Olivia Newton-John, theaters across the country are bringing her hit, Grease, back to the big screen. Showtimes start next week in North Texas, including at the Angelica and IPIC. Some family fun at your home theater as well, starring Dallas's Owen Wilson. Your dad's a superhero. No, my dad can't handle hot wings. Please don't do In secret headquarters, a kid discovers the secret lair of his favorite superhero below his father's home. So Turns out his idol, the Guardian, is actually kind of his dad, played by Wilson. Your dad's a superhero. And he's thinking you're just not quite available, and then coming to find out that, whoa, dad, um, dad's been up to some um, heroic deeds. Save my dad's tech before they destroy the world. We got this. Secret Headquarters streaming on Paramount Plus.